Oop. Hello again, folks. This is Boba the Vulture. This is Let's Play Uncharted Waters New Horizons. And, uh, last time I spent all of my money on carpet. So, let's hope that uh, turns out to have been uh, a, a wise investment. Five barrels of water, five barrels of food. Five. Well, how long will I be able to sail with that much? Or there, maybe will you be shoving off? And sail for ten days. I tell you what. Let's supply. Let's, uh... Hey, you know what? Let's supply all. Why not? It's not gonna make that huge a difference one way or the other. We can sail for eleven days. I'm going to need to just head straight for home. Well, after I've discovered a few ports along the way. Thanks to my awesome crew. Wait, no, I don't want to set my destination. What I wanted to do was, uh, yeah. Let me uh, check the rations here. Oh, they're at 80%. You guys are already okay. Commodore, we found the port of Syracuse. Let's stop there and eat. We're gonna stop in Syracuse. It's cool by me. It is a neutral port in the Mediterranean. Alright. Boy there, will you be shoving off? Let's get supplies. Ten barrels of water and food. 190 gold pieces. Uh, yes. Let's set sail. Eleven more days out in the ocean, out in the seas, the excitement, the drama. The discovery. I found the Port of Palma. I didn't even know it was missing. Aha! Alright, um, probably should stop here and... Yeah. Get a bite to eat. For my crew. You know, I like to keep my crew well fed. What, what? Ahoy there, matey. Will I be shoving off? Uh, let me supply it. Thirteen barrels of water and food. I am almost out of Cachola, but let's go ahead and set sail. Alright. Heading out. Tra la 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 la. Connect the dots. La 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 la. Now would be a good time for one of my eagle-eyed lookouts to find a port. Commodore, our crew was paid. They got paid, son! We're gonna stop in Bordeaux. It is allied with Portugal. It's 11 in the morning. It's morning in America. I'm sorry, it's morning in France. Let's, uh, assign the crew. How many crew do we have? We still have 30. Okay, and nobody's starved to death or anything yet. Do we still have food and water? Yeah, we still had food and water. What am I always so worried about? Uh... Now, yeah, Bordeaux. I believe I can figure out what their specialty is from the Bordeaux region. How might I help you? What can I do for you? What can I do for you? 350, that is a good return on investment. Pew, cash. Cash money hoes. Let's buy some goods. Raisins are the local speciality. That price is acceptable. Raisins will cost you 38. Is that okay? No? How much would I pay? How about 36? 
And then how much would you pay? How about 37? Yay, 37. I will purchase 20 lots of raisins. That's good. Let's get going. Fill up the rest with uh, fill up the rest with foods, money foods, some kind of foods, delicious dining. Wait, no, 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 no. We won't be able to sail for long if we do that. Let's get supplies. Yes, eight barrels of stuff. Let's set sail. We can sail for ten days. So I guess if you're going to be able to sail for less than a week. Your man tells you we won't be able to sail for long. Good thing, because, you know, that isn't very long. So there's two days. Sun rises. Day three. So we are able to make it to Amsterdam. We're going to stop there. Yeah. Northern Europe, the capital of Holland. And it is 2.30 in the morning. Um, just because, you know, I'm awake at this hour. I might as well. A limited time only. Special items. Bye, bye, bye. I'm sure you'll find something you like. Poke watch. Gotta catch it all. Poke watch. Because it's pocket watch, you see. Four in the morning and people are abuzz with activity. I'm going to go ahead and sell those raisins. How may I help you? Would you like to buy some raisins? I bought them for 38. 58! Yes, please. Buy my raisins. We don't have any goods to sell. It's okay, man. I might come back and buy some glass beads later, but for right now... Well, first of all, I'm going to check in with my boy Mercator. So, Ernst, have you gotten used to sea travel yet? You know I have. Let's, uh, give him a report. Thank you for all your hard work. Here's your pay. Come back again. I will, Mercator. Thanks again for the ship, which is really kind of terrible. Um, let's get going, though. Commoners are usually not admitted here, but the king is interested in meeting with you. Please follow me. Let us meet the ruler. Hello there, Ernst. I've heard quite a bit about you lately. You look like someone I can count on. I'd like you to do a task for me. I've heard you're quite an adventurer. I want you to travel the world and find rare things, but your discoveries are for me only, so don't tell anyone else. Uh, yeah, I won't tell anybody, sure. If you successfully complete this task, I'll bestow upon you a royal title. You discovered the Rosetta Stone? Nice work! But the world's still full of marvelous things. Go and find me something else. I'm bored of the Rosetta Stone now, seconds after you told me of its existence. You discovered the crocodile? Nice work! But the world is still full of marvelous things. I don't care if I've now seen a crocodile eat a Rosetta Stone. You discover the Nubia Pyramid? That's fantastic! Please accept this title. From this day forth, you will be known as Page Von Bohr. Oh man, I kind of liked the name Ernst. Okay, let's uh, talk to him. Talk about a tax-free permit. Your permit is valid for half a year. You must renew it every April and October. Will you request a tax-free permit? Sure. Then let me take your request to His Majesty. Welcome, Page Von Bohr. So I hear you would like to have a tax-free permit from my country. It's our country, man. It will cost you 60,000 gold pieces. Um, never mind. Now, would it be forward of me to ask for gold or a ship? I kind of want a new ship, but I'll be afraid of the kind that he would give me at this point. I'll ask for gold. 
Majesty thinks you gotta make it on your own. Well, Alright. If I couldn't get a ship. Or if I couldn't get money, I certainly wouldn't be able to get a ship from the guy. Well, alright. I tell you what, before I go and purchase rock salt, let me go up here and talk to somebody at the guild. What do you want? Give me a job. Can I deliver a letter for you? Do you consider taking this level to the guild in the port of Beirut? It has to be there within one month. Beirut. Hang on, how would I get to Beirut? Hold on a moment, I'm just trying to think of, uh... Ah! Yeah, I could get to Beirut. Sure, I could get to Beirut in a month. I will get your letter to Beirut speedy fast! I'll pay you once you've finished the job. Let's see, 700 ought to be enough. Oh, I see. That's how it's gonna be. Well, fine. I can do that. And, uh... I'll go ahead and... I mean, I was gonna head down that way anyways. So maybe what I'll just do for right now is... Out of my way, buddy! Out of my way! How may I help you? What can I do for you? What can I do for you? Yes, 20% tax, I know. Hey, I've got an ingot. Glass beads are three now. Oh, lame. That price is acceptable. No, then how much would I pay? I'd pay two. Why is my shirt selling such a low price? Three, fine, you drive a hard bargain. All right, I accept. That is my ship. Come on, you know what my ship is. I'll get 20 lots of glass beads going. And then get out of here. I've got one gold ingot, folks. My first gold ingot. Cap Marts, I need. I heard talk around the port that Mercator's maps have been getting popular. And I heard that both Mercator and you were Mercator. I tend to say Mercator, but I've heard Mercator as well. Um, I suppose I should know the pronunciation of this guy who's employing us, but, hey, uh, you know, whatever. I heard that both Mercator and you, Ernst, are listed as cartographers. That's great, but we can't let the fame go to our heads. We'll have to work even harder from here on out. Right-o, Captain, let's move her out to seamen. Did I hear someone say seamen? Oh, please, wait a minute. Can you take me on your ship? Huh, are you crazy, miss? There's no place for children on a ship. Get along home now, lassie. Are you the captain, mister? Please, let me aboard. I'll prove my worth. I can speak any language in the world. Guan Ping! Why, yes, I am the captain. What's your name? I'm Paula. Please let me aboard, captain. I want to find my homeland. Your homeland? What do you mean you're looking for your homeland? I want to hear about this. I'm interested in this. And by the way, I'm Ernst von Bohr, an adventurer traveling the globe to make a world map. Ah! A world map! I just jumped. So, you mean you're the famous von Bohr of Mercator and von Bohr? Yes. Well, if you don't mind, maybe you'd tell me why you want to board my ship? I... A couple of days ago, my father died. His... Yeah, his brother Guan Yu was killed and he was in grief and... Anyways, right before he died, he said to me, I have to tell you the truth. I'm not your real father. Ten years ago, he found me in the markets of Seville. I was only four years old, so he took me and raised me as his own. My father, the man who raised me, was a traitor, so he traveled all over the world. He said that he searched for my real parents wherever he went, but he never found them, and so I've been with him ever since. Your homeland, find your homeland. Those were my father's last words. Ah, I jumped again. I beg you, please let me aboard. I swear I won't jump as much usually. But... Oh, Professor, this barnacle back hasn't heard such a touching story in many a year. What a brave young lassie. Going out to Sloan to search for her homeland. I say we let her aboard. But Hans, didn't you just say there was no room for... 
Oh well, come along then, miss. Come along, miss. Oh, thank you. I mean, oh, thank you! Ahoy there, matey. Will you be shoving off? Well, let me get some supplies first. Yeah, you know. Supplies. 200 gold pieces. I can manage. Will you be shoving off? Let's sail away! So, heading to the Mideast, folks. That is the order of the day. I, uh, maybe she, here we go, yeah. Let's stop in Nantes. It is a neutral port in Northern Europe. Oh wait, it's 2 a.m. I should go to their item shop. Oh no, now it's 3 a.m. The item shop will be closed. I spent an hour just walking in and out the door there. It's closed. Darn, I'm sure that you had the best item ever, too. They might have, I don't know. Ahoy there, matey. Will you be shoving off? Well, after I get some goods. 171 gold pieces. Will you be shoving off? Yes. Let's sail away. You know, just stopping periodically for supplies. Let's stop in Lisbon. This is the capital of Portugal. Mm. Out of curiosity, how much are you going to buy glass beads for? I doubt for very much, but you never know. Um, you want to buy some glass beads? Aha, no. I'm just kind of curious. Rock salt's the specialty. Right. Rock salt costs more these days. The kids these days and their rock salt. <laughs> I'll never understand it. Boy there, matey. Will ye be shoving off? Let me get some supplies. Okay. Now then, let's uh, head off. We can sail for 43 days. What? Okay, what happened? Did a bunch of my crew die? A bunch of my crew died. Do you guys have scurvy or something? We have seven crew members. How do I examine the crew health? That would be a good thing to know. Check in the journal here. Doesn't really say anything about uh, their relative health. Doesn't say anything to me either. Not that menu. Is there another menu I can check out here? No. Well, I tell you what. Um, let me go to the bar and recruit some more dudes. I kind of need to do that. Recruit some dudes. I need at least six more dudes. I think it's six. How many do I have going right now? Transfer crew. I have seven crew, so I need a minimum of three. I should probably get, like... Let's see, transfer crew. I should probably get... 13. Mm. Yeah, 13. 13 sounds good. Hello, Ernst. Would you like some tea? Hey, you know who I am, eh? 
I will treat people for gold. I'll buy. Thirteen. What? Are you the famous adventurer Ernst von Bord? Yes, yes I am. Hey, any of you tough sailors want to join my crew? We rounded up 88 men. 44 gold per sailor. I'm going to hire 13. Yes, and they will all go on the Mercator. How many will I assign? I will assign all of them to my ship. That's okay. Yes. Now then. Actually, I'm going to reassign how the crew is looking at stuff. I will, yeah, um... Actually, yes. Wait, no, 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 no. Um... 60... 40? Gets us how many? Nah... How about 55? And... 45. Yeah, that's cool. I suppose in theory I could, uh... have just gone with an even split. Lucy is our busiest waitress. You'll have to tip her ten gold pieces first. I gotta tell her some stories. The Rosetta Stone. You interested? It has a value of D. Wow, that's so exciting. I wonder what kind of people lived there long ago on that stone. I'm at a crocodile. It has a value of C. It is a fierce, ambitious predator. You heard all that. Wow, it's so exciting. Weren't you scared? No, baby. I'm Ernst von Bohr. I'm not afraid of nothing. Well, you see, Pyramid. Wow, that's so exciting. What kind of people lived there? Well, pyramids were typically used as burial structures, but... Um... I'll ask her for about info. What do I want to know? Port info. Well, that's a secret! What do you want to know? Job info. Fuck you, lady! Now that. Bernardo Sanchez and Aluigi Giovanni. Oh, hey there, matey. How's life on the high seas? I'm a vagabond sailor. I'll have you a drink. You're buying me the cafe's specialty? Seems like we'll get along well. I hate to brag, but I have a knack for knowledge. Oh, yeah? What gossip do you know? I do like the port's tea. Would you like to come work for me? Sorry, I'm not interested. I don't like sail experienced navigators. What if I gave you another drink? Yeah, I hear that you have a knack for knowledge. Now do you want to work for me? Fine. I don't want to get my heart broken again. What about the Bernardo Sanchez? Oh, hey there, matey. How's life on the high seas? I'm a vagabond sailor. Thank you. Omen was looking for a job, and he's in Seville. You wanna join me? You wanna work for me? Your ship? Look, man. I'm like the legendary sailor Popeye, the sailor man now. Why is everybody so... Like, uh, I don't wanna work for you. You're sticky. You're like girls. Alright. Forget it, forget it. Let's just... <sighs> Let's just supply up our ship. And we'll get going. Oh, we don't have more space left in the hold. Well then, let's uh, sail. We can sail for 15 days. A little bit longer than when we had the uh, slightly larger crew, right? That's right. Minute, where am I going? I gotta get to Lebanon. On the double. We're gonna stop in Algiers just for a bite of brunch. Oh, it's a neutral port. Do you guys want my glass beads? 
How much do you want to buy my glass beads for? You Algerians. You don't want to buy them for nothing. Come on. Isn't anybody impressed by my glass beads anymore? Will you be shoving off? I will be getting supplies. Yeah, 120 gold. I'll go ahead and uh, shove off. 15 days! I forgot, you can press the R button and it will tell you how long you've been out at sea. Three days, okay. We got plenty of time then. Hey, look. Greece. Four days. This, I believe, will be start of day five. Commodore, we found the port of Jaffa. Makers of Jaffa cakes. We found Beirut. What do you know? We're gonna stop there because that's where we got to give a letter. My baby, she wrote me a letter. She wrote me a letter, so she couldn't live without me no more. Listen to me, mister, I just gotta get back to my baby once for more. Anyway, yeah. Anyway, yeah. Let's stop by the bar and be all bar flash. Anybody here to meet? Just Hans. Commodore, let's not spend too much time in the cafe. Okay. Interested in playing cards with me? Wolverine? Snicked! Place your bet. I will place a bet of... 50. Good luck! I have to let you win sometimes. Will you let it ride? Ride, 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 let it ride. Ah, sure, why not? If you win, you'll double your bet. But if you lose, it's all gone. Hit me. Hit me again. Jeez. Ah. Hit. 23. Sorry, you lost your bet. Another bet? Nope, that's good. That should have taken enough time for it to be 2 a.m. now. 2.30. I gotta run. I gotta get to the store before they close. Hey, friend. Unlimited time only. We're selling special items. You wanna buy the special items? Bomb. This stuff's the bomb. Thousand gold pieces. Jeez. I mean, excuse me. I mean, I know I'm gonna need bomb eventually, but uh, now I'll buy it another time. A thousand bucks is still serious money to a guy like me. All right, let's uh, head up here. Oh, is this a letter from Amsterdam? Good work. I was waiting for this. You can collect your payment at the port of Amsterdam. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess I could. Or I could get my money from you. Let's go to the market. How much do you want for glass beads here in Amsterdam? Hmm? 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 Glass beads? They are glassy. Glassy and interesting. One. Market rate of one. Well, nuts, folks. Nuts and milk. Okay. Ahoy there, matey. Will ye be shoving off? Um. I'll supply, of course, first. What am I think? Ten barrels of water and eleven barrels of food will cost me 220 gold pieces. That's okay. 
Will you be shoving off? Nope, I'll be shoving off next time, folks. Um, I think next time what I'm going to do is try and actually complete my uh, little tour down the Nile there. And uh, look for interesting and exotic things and stuff. And then, uh, I guess... No, you know, maybe then I'll just, uh, if I find anybody to sell the beads to down there, great. See if I can pick up some cool items or something. Uh, otherwise, I'll, uh, find some place to offload the beads. Maybe in, uh, West Africa. And, uh, then just head back up to Amsterdam so I can collect my money and tell, uh, what's-his-face, the governor regent, all about all the fun, neat stuff I got to do. Won't that be great? Anyhow, this is Bobo the Vulture. This is Let's Play Uncharted Waters New Horizons. And uh, I thank you very much for watching. See you next time.